Today, we're going to attempt to take one of the most exciting young fullbacks in football from a wonder kid to a superstar. Let's get into it. Hey everyone, it's me, Andrew, on FM Scout. I'm also known as The Gib Show. And before we get going, please make sure you are subscribed to the FM Scout YouTube channel. And if you enjoy this video, always drop a like on it. It means a lot to see those likes jump up. It shows that I'm doing a good job as well. And one last thing, if you can be so kind, go into the description, click on my channel, The Gib Show, drop a subscribe on there. Watch some videos, let me know what you think. The player in question is Goncalo Estevez. I apologise if I've said his name wrong. I've tried, I've tried. He's got the high potential of 170, 17 years old in 2021, and we're going to go through 10 years, and we're going to see if he can become one of the greatest fullbacks in the game. I do my Wonder Kid things a little bit different. I'm not going to move him teams. We're going to sim through, we're going to make sure he plays, we're going to make sure he trains the way we want him to train, but I'm going to leave his fate and his direction of career up to the director of footballs of the clubs he plays at. He's going to start at Sporting, we'll sim through, if he moves, we'll then move to that team, we'll see how he goes again, if he moves again, we'll move to that team and see if we can get him all the way through to his career. So we're starting here at Sporting. He is 17. He probably would be behind Pedro Poro and Ricardo Escaio uh, in, that, in that position at right back. But we're going to make sure he plays every game so we can get him developing. And this is the formation we're going to use. It's a simple 4-2, 3-1, Gingham press. Got him as a win back on attack. He's going to bomb up there, get down the channels, use the runs of the inside forward, hopefully get the ball into... The, the pressing forward in there and the CM on attack will be getting in there as well. See if we can get him some assists. In terms of current ability, he starts at this save at 110. The best player at Sporting is Sebastian Quates at 158. Long way to go. And we've obviously got 60 points to make up. 10 years to do it. So we will sim through until, probably till he moves clubs or three years. And then we'll see how he's getting on. It didn't take long for Estevez to get his first move. His first season, he played 46 games, got 14 assists for Sporting. Then played half a season, uh, 30 games, 8 assists, 2 point of the matches. And then Bayer Leverkusen came calling, paid 6.75 million for him, took him to Germany. And yeah, he's now in the Bundesliga and he's made 8 appearances this season, didn't play every game. But he's got his first big move. Good fee as well. Where is he in terms of development? He's gone up to 126 of 170. He's 19 years old. Now let's have a look at him. We've got crossing 10. Physicals are there apart from jumping reach. He is only 5 foot 9. We're not expecting much of his jumping. The mentals for a 19 year old are excellent. Work rate, teamwork, off the ball for going forward. Position in 11 is absolutely fine. Determination is there to hopefully see him get into the higher levels of his potential anticipation aggression i'm liking the dribble in the first touch his passing's good tackling and technique like, there's nothing not to like about estevez here you can see why buyer pulled the trigger uh, and we'll see how his career goes in the next couple of years he's already got a value of 21 to 31 million will they cash in in a couple of years will he be able to maintain those levels those assists at this like higher level of ability in Germany. Let's find out. It's 2026. Already we can see here, highest average rating, Gonchalo Estevez, 7.51. Over a season, Bayer have came in third, only seven points off the title as well. But just seeing that, you're like, no matter what he's doing, he's not he's not got the most assists, he's not scoring goals, obviously, but he's got the highest average rating. We're up to 148 current abilities, 22 years old. Now he's a four-star fullback. 
wanted by Man United, Tottenham, Bayer, Inter, Real Madrid, Sociedad. He's doing all right. Value shot up to 43 to 59 million. He's gotten faster. The physicals are developing beautifully. Crossing's gone up a little bit. The mentals are, yeah, they're, they're all there, aren't they? They're all there. Decision 16 is excellent. When to give the ball away, when to pass, when to cross, when not to. Yeah, it looks, it looks a really good player. First full season in Germany, he got 9 assists in 50 games. 6.98, and then 8 assists in 39, and then this season, although, although only 13 assists in 34 games. It's the average rating of 7.47 in the league, 7.51 overall, excellent in the cup. He's one of their best players, like, he was their best player average rating wise. And even though he's maybe not killing it in terms of loads of assists, he is playing exceptionally well. There you go, you can see Bayer there, outside of Bayern, with 25 goals conceded. Bayer got the second best defensive record, and you've got to find that Estevez is part of that. Uh, let's see how his career develops again. We'll come back in a few years' time. We're now in 2029. You can see their buyer have gone even closer. They've come second. 71 points, 8 behind Bayern, they're pushing for that title, and how involved is our man Estevez? Here we go, he's up to 158, he's only 12 off his full potential, he's 25 years old, he might struggle to get to 170 now, but he is a, he's got 110,000 pound a week, he's doing alright. An average rating of 7.27 is the third best in the whole team. Part of that defence, look, with that all looking at... Estevez, they've got Leroy Sani now. Absolutely super, absolutely smashing it. Wanted by Man City. Interesting. Although all teams seem to have faded away, he's still, still wanted. 177 games for Bayer. And he's just consistently averaging in the sevens 7.23, 7 7.19. I mean, like the assist numbers maybe aren't where you'd want them to be in terms of a fullback. You can definitely get more if you play more aggressive or have what different players up front. But he is constantly getting the ratings. Meaning he's playing really well. Meaning he is contributing to Bayer and their excellent defensive record. Yeah. 26 goals conceded in that kind of season. 18 and 22 is phenomenal numbers from Bayer and Dortmund. 26 is excellent. 70 goals scored at the second highest. Yeah. You're not going to catch Bayern when they start getting silly re silly regens like this guy. Ooh, he's amazing. <laughs> but it's Estevez now, like, physical monster, anticipation decisions up to 17, position in 14, off the ball 15. So he's a force on both sides of the pitch, uh, both going forward and getting back. Marking 14, tackling 13, his crossing's up to 12. This is an all-round, all-round player with absolutely beautiful hair as well. We reached the end of the 10 years, it's 2031, and here he is, Gonçalo Estevez at Manchester City. 40 million Baron got from City for him. He's played, what, 16, 69 league games? Got himself 18 assists. Again, continuing in the Premier League to average over a 7 for a fullback. In this game where defence is definitely not the best thing, you know, the easiest thing to replicate, and he's averaging over a 7. And it's not like he's got 20 assists and it's just through assists. This is through defensive performance as well. Uh, he's not quite maxed out his potential. He's on 161, which is still phenomenal. He's 27 years old. He's on 135 grand a week. Playing for Man City and absolutely bossing it. Decision's gone up to 18. Like that, that is Premier League, Champions League like quality, isn't it? Uh, stamina, 16. Pace, 17. He's got that natural fitness to get up and down the channel constantly. A really, really good player. Looking at him from in the last 10 years, like, superb. Ended up with, like, 91 assists over his career, nearly 10 a season. Can't argue with that. And maybe, like, better players, better strikers up front. 
you could get more you could put him as like an inverted wing back on attack and sort of game the system a little bit but an absolutely tremendous player to look at if you need a right back say Barr got him from, from well, 6.75 million after two seasons get him in early get him playing get him training make him whatever kind of fullback you want he's got it all if you like what you see with Gonchalo Estevez make sure you drop a like on the video give him a rating out of 10 I think I'm going to go for an 8 not phenomenal but really really good really really like him someone I've not, I've not really got a save I can buy him in at the moment but if he's there for FC Andorra the link below my, my YouTube save I might try and get him still I've not quite reached 2031 so I might still get a good player there Please subscribe to the FM Scout YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my channel, The Gibbs Show. Like the video, drop us a comment, let you know what you think of Estevez. Give them a rating out of 10. Uh, we'll be back with more Wonder Kids, more tactics, more experiments. For me, Andrew, thanks for watching. Bye for now.